today I have a little bit of a talk about my heart for the bigger goals and interview for today. And today, we have our special guest from Kapatayan Dance Group and we'll ask her some questions about her dance group. Please welcome our guest for today, Ms. Rose Namada. Hello everyone and thank you for inviting me to the dance group. It's my pleasure, so let's start. Ms. Rose Namada, how's your night um, actually, I am quite busy with my academics and also my passion, which is that thing. So I'm going to ask you some questions. Oh, okay. How did you become a dancer? Please tell us something about your journey. Well, I became a dancer since I was in kindergarten. I was wearing a crop top and also a skirt and a mouth bell on for me. When I was in kindergarten, I discovered that I am good at the, I am good at that um, specific passion. So yeah, it, it evolves and evolves until on on high school, senior high school, I joined a lot of competitions. Yeah, I joined a lot of competitions, also dance school on school on the outside. So when you're in high school, your time is um, hard times and yes. yes. Okay. Um. The next question is, what inspires you to dance? Um. Give me some. Okay. Um. What inspires me to dance is the one that I admire is from international dancers. How can you name them specifically? Um. Yeah, she is. Um, a hip hop dancer, she uh, is. I can't her name, but her name is uh, Baby So. She is a Korean and she does so uh, nice and she has this um, unique style. So I want to become her. She has so many recognition as a dancer and I want to be like her. So now that I um, follow her footsteps, so basically I want to become like her. So that inspired me to go because she, uh, she, she didn't inspire me when it comes to that. Uh, in that she also uh, inspired me with her. Uh, um, knowledge about that's that's I, I watch all her videos on YouTube, on YouTube, also on TikTok. I follow her social media accounts and I saw how she improved as a dancer and how she uh, played other dancers internationally and uh, like she joined workshops. She's known a dancer. I admire also the picture dancer, which is Diana Guerrero. If you will know her, I'll know her. Yeah, she does so nice and her moves is unique and extraordinary. She is also um, an artist. Yes. Yeah, I, I admire her so much. Yeah. Because she danced, she didn't dance that um, well before. She improved a lot because she joined workshops, trainings, yes. some of them. She was some of her, yes. It is good to hear that you are so passionate about your time. Thank you. Seeing people who are so good to dance, uh, make you want to try to. <laughs> you must. <laughs> okay, for my third question. Describe the best performance ever to come. What do you learn from it? Well, uh, I remember I joined the dance art competition. I trained for two months. I trained for two months, and during that uh, training, like I discovered my style. During that day, I like I realized that oh, this is my style. This is uh, so uh, this is my strength. Yeah, like I discovered my identity as a dancer. So when I danced dance art, it became my favorite style. So I joined this rap competition. That was a help in Marvel, and it was fun because a lot of um, a lot. Of a lot of teachers, a lot of students, and Mark came doing that. And also, it became, uh, I mean, it continues. I perform a lot of competition, I do mission uh, with that, that uh, with my style, that's why. And yes, that performance is basically my, um, what was the question? The best performance. Uh, the best performance ever. Uh, dancing, that's why. And that was so um, an incredible story that it has not, that was not a big talk to other person, but also your, um, the way you uh, grow. Yes. Uh, last question. Any advice you would like to give to uh, upcoming dancers? Well, my advice is simple. Be positive, even though um, you're starting from the bottom. Just keep on um, helping yourself. Don't don't push too hard to, to the point that it will stress you out. Like, it will become your problem. So, to all dancers out there, you must also help yourself to improve as an answer because I started, I mean, I've been there, I started from the, from the low, the, from the lowest. I, uh, I am not good at first, but I hope I start. I, train, I joined workshops, trainings, and I dance, uh, I mean, I copied dancing, dances in YouTube, TikTok, but not social media platforms. And yeah, just continue your passion if stay positive and don't quit. Um, enjoy the music, enjoy the rhythm, enjoy the steps you, you take and also don't mind the bashers because I mean they will not I mean they will help you to mold you as a person. You take the um their feedback inspiration for us to to become a good dancer and to, to become a good person. Don't um take um that as negative, take that as a positive. 
Oh, who is faster than that? Yeah, so that was nice. Um, a nice. Thank you. Uh, for our third of your generation, it was a problem of success. Yes. Thank you for the day. Thank, Thank you also for inviting me, Ms. Mar. So, and so, so, uh, again, thank you for watching our Young and Talk show. Um, I am my pleasure to attend at this show and invite. Uh, yes, thank you so much. Okay, thank you, bye. bye.